All right, what you got going on here, old Ethan? Well, been thinking. You know, whenever we go up to North Missouri on our uh, annual rut trip, usually, you know, we pack our coolers and all this kind of stuff, and we're, uh, we've got to pack a lot of ice and buy groceries and stuff like that, and by about halfway through, we're running back to town to get ice. So what I've been trying to throw around is seeing if these freeze-dried mountain house meals are any good. So me and Dustin are gonna try the lasagna and give y'all a uh, first impressions. I'm kind of interested about this, cause. Oh, and then, and then, what's the the special thing you're gonna well, throw on top? What I've heard is that if you throw a cheese stick in it and let the boiling water melt the cheese stick while you put it back into your your thing here, but here's what it looks like inside. It's just freeze dried lasagna and meat sauce. Mmm. I mean, really, the ingredients. It's straight up what you think it should be. You think it's we could live off that at deer camp? Maybe. But what I'm looking at is just if it's a practicality because you can actually just make your own and do your own recipes and take out a lot of the sodium content. So what I'm gonna do is I got two cups of water here boiling and I'm gonna pour them real nice and easy into here and hope I don't die. Oh, look at it. It's hitting the cheese. Oh, it's bubbling. Get it all worked up here and get that cheese stick down in there. It's starting to look tasty. Yep. So what we do is we seal it up and let it sit for 10 minutes. It's got a little zipper where you can reseal it, so just be careful so you don't yeah, and burn your hand off. Yeah. I had earlier this week some of their chicken salad. And all you have to do with it is do uh let me see here. Timer. Let's do nine. So anyway, I tried the chicken salad and it's just cold water and you mix it up for 10 minutes. <laughs> and what's really weird is that's probably one of the best chicken salads I ever had. Really? And you looked at it, yeah, it had like pumpkin seeds, cranberries, so you got a little bit of a crunch to it. You got the chicken salad, you got the real chicken, and it was way more than I could eat. I ate three big sandwiches of it. So, so you're saying them things be handy, you're trying to see if they're handy to like throw in your backpack? Yeah, like that one would be really handy for like whenever you're in your backpack or whatever, and you know, for lunch, if you wanted to make chicken salad and you and your buddy in the stand, you know, if we're filming, we could share chicken salad. What are those little, uh, carry some wraps and a canister to get the water to boil, like a jet boil yeah, or something like boil. that? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look into getting one of those or a butane stove of some sort or something like that. And that way it's all in one thing. But you know, like we talked about, we may look into making our own dehydrated meals because Dustin said he thinks he has a dehydrator, so yeah. Look at all that water behind you. You ever seen that much in one place? <laughs> when you get a deal on water, you get a deal on water. <laughs> we will be set for deer camp. Yeah. Because we go through water now. Yeah, you got but a lot anyway. of stores that just open. Yeah, so anyway, we'll tune back here in just a minute and let y'all know what it looks like when it opens. I say. Maybe. Maybe. You can dip, the, yeah, dip in that cheese stick in there. All right. You ready for this? Good to hand open. Mmm. What's your first impression of this? Dude, that smells like mom's lasagna. <laughs> That's good. That's, yep. I mean, it smells good. Very appealing to the Here. sensory. We'll force. stir it around a little bit. Make sure that Let cheese is all melted. Let's see how it is on feel. That's good feel to it. Nice and squishy. <laughs> yeah. All right. Dude, I guarantee. Oh, look at that cheese, dude. Got some good cheese in there. Well, it's not all the way melted yet. Hey. Dude, if I was hungry All right. after seven days, so camp. you get the first taste. This is no seasoning in there or anything. Oh, I figure it's gonna need some uh, the chunk old. up. Well, I'm trying to get the cheese stick. Oh, melt it up. Spread around. 
Because we want our cheese evenly divided throughout the package. <laughs> yes, we do. Because we're dangerously cheesy. Dangerously cheesy. All right, let's try our sucker and see what we got. It's probably hot. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> it burns my innards. Dude, that, that is that is wildless, wildlessly tasteful right there. And I don't even know if that makes sense, but that was good. It, it burns a little. <laughs> yeah, my tongue's a little numb. <laughs> you try it now. Let's see what you got. I, I don't know if I want to take a bite yet. It's hot to do. That, man, that, that is a game changer, really. Especially if we can make our own. You know? Oh, yeah. I'm gonna blow on this for a little bit. <laughs> Come on, stay wild. Hey, the first thing you gotta remember is take this out before you- Yeah, do not it. eat the package. That's the first thing on the instructions. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I you feel it, you. don't you? That's good. <laughs> We're having lasagna at Deer Camp this year. <laughs> I bet you've even had more like shredded cheese, like mozzarella to throw yeah. in there. Oh, dude. I want more. That cheese all stuck to the spoon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, those things are definitely better than what I thought. I just in thought- In reality, cause I mean, come down here and look at the ingredient list. It's just lasagna. It's Parmesan Romano cheese. Mozzarella cheese, tomatoes, tomato paste, macaroni, cooked beef, onion, cornstarch, sugar, spice, and garlic powder. It's not anything crazy. Yeah, well. Now what, we know. You think we're gonna bring some of them on deer camp? I know what more. I know. <laughs> Especially like, cause I hear the breakfast skillet, which is like your eggs, sausage, um, hash browns and all, stuff. All it's, the good stuff. Yeah, onions and peppers. It's supposedly the best thing that they have. And then number two is their biscuits and gravy. It's supposed to be number two. And everybody says it tastes just like homemade biscuits and gravy. Oh. So, <laughs> if we can start out the meals every day with a big breakfast, you know, we'll be able to, you know, make it through a lot of the day. Yeah, yeah. Because you know I mean? normally, what do we have for breakfast up there? Uh, honey if, bun? If somebody gets up early enough, we got coffee. Yeah, maybe a honey bun. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway. That's our take, and it's good. Yeah. If you ever decide you want to try it some is. of them for... Uh, it is the first of Akron Reviews. Oh, yeah. What brand is that right there? You got uh, it from the Mountain, Academy? Mountain House. Mountain House, it is they good. They sell at Walmart and Academy. Might as well put my name on there because it's got my vote. It's got what? It's got, <laughs> it's got my vote. Oh. <laughs> All right. Y'all stay wild. I'm Eat some hungry. crazy stuff. I'm stay hungry. And if you choose that, you'll be satisfied. <laughs> Get a bowl.